Today, I'm gonna to take you through one of five completed homes in Ankeny under 350,000. Yeah, I said under 350,000. The crossings at Deer Creek has been in the plan for about 10 years now. It's only been about three years they broke ground. And since they broke ground, they can't put the streets in fast enough. They once said, if you build it, they will come. They built it and they've come. Now this plan is the Ashton Plan by Jerry's Homes. The Ashton Plan is part of the Root Series. Now here's the thing that Jerry's Homes did with the Root Series plans. They named each one of their plans after a famous actor or a famous person from the state of Iowa. This one is the Ashton, named after Ashton Kutcher, a famous actor. One of the things you might notice about this house while we're walking through it, it's a little bit dirty. Well, I need to do the video before the house is completed because once this house is completed and clean, it's gonna sell. Now let's talk about the floor plan. This is a 1,605 square foot two-story. It's got three bedrooms on the second level, and if you decide you wanna finish the basement, you can add a fourth down in the basement. Speaking of the basement, you can add about 600 finished square feet, and it's gonna cost around $28,000, but you get a bathroom, a bedroom, and a nice living space. Now, if you can tell, this floor plan is open. This area right here is where you put your dining table, they chose to go with the white cabinets and the white quartz countertops, absolutely beautiful together, and stainless steel appliances. One cool thing about this is you can stand right here, do your dishes, and you can see the kids playing out in the backyard. That's definitely featured me as a parent of five. I really appreciate that. Now, another thing that's really nice, being a parent of five, is a built-in pantry. Tons of space for storage in here. You won't regret having a pantry. So where should we go next? Should we check out the basement or should we head upstairs? Let's save the basement for later. Let's check out upstairs. One of the things I like about this floor plan is when you walk in that front door, you immediately see this cool staircase with the stained wood for nice accents. And you also have a cool window right here at the bottom of the stairs. You can walk down, see what's going on outside before you head in and have breakfast. So here we are on the second level. The second level features three bedrooms, laundry room, and two bathrooms. We're gonna head into this first spare bedroom and check this one out. This is the first of the two spare bedrooms. They measure around 11 foot by 12 foot. Plenty of room for bunk beds and kids are gonna absolutely love this space. They're also gonna love this Jack and Jill bathroom. Come check it out. So this is the Jack and Jill bathroom. Now this has access from both bedrooms, which is absolutely amazing. Another cool feature, it has two sinks, which keeps the kids from fighting over which sink is theirs. And then we walk right into the last spare bedroom, but really, let's get to that master bedroom. So here we are in the master bedroom. A couple cool features about this master bedroom. It's got a ceiling fan, it's got a tray ceiling, it measures around 13 by 15, so there's plenty of space. Now here in the master bath, you've got double vanity, so you got two sinks, but you also have a row of drawers, so there's tons of storage, and you have plenty of room here on the counter for all the hair products, so you guys don't have to fight over space. And just as essential as a pantry is to a kitchen, you gotta have a linen closet. Linen closets are so important. And as you walk through the bathroom, you got your shower and then you got your master closet back here. Now, why would you want your master closet through the bathroom? You don't wake up at the same time all the time. So it's kind of nice to be able to walk in, shut the door, get ready for work without disturbing your partner. So one of the coolest features about this house in particular, I want to take you straight to the basement. Now check this out. And just like that, we're in the basement. Now I'm gonna show you the layout of this basement, so you're gonna have to use your imagination just a little bit. They got these high transom windows. What's cool about that is it lets some light in, but it also doesn't take up your wall where you might wanna have furniture, because this here is your living space. And if you float back here to the back of the basement, you've got your bedroom with an egress window. And I would say that you probably wanna have your closet right here. That will give you a buffer of sound from your family room to the bedroom. And back here, you got your bathroom. So when you walk in, You've got your bedroom here, or you've got your bathroom right here. And this is your storage area. So now it's time for us to go check out this backyard that I've been telling you about. So here we are on this back deck I've been telling you about. Again, in the evening, you're gonna have shade, so you can sit out here, relax, and enjoy yourself without sweating to death. Now, if you look out through the backyard, you got this pond. It's a frozen tundra out here right now, so that pond might be better for ice skating or ice fishing. 
But one cool thing about this development is just beyond these houses back here, the city of Ankeny has in their 20 year comp plan, another high school. So there's another opportunity for more families to move to the area and enjoy the space. Plus they're bringing a Costco just in a couple months. So that's pretty cool too. Now, if you like this video and you wanna see more, subscribe to our channel. We got a lot more coming. We'd love to have you hang around with us. Oh,